Welcome Authentic Oracle 1111. This is your reading for the week. So we're going to start with a little protection prayer before we begin. So I'm going to have you take a deep breath and release it. I'm going to ask that we're surrounded by pure white light today. I'm going to ask to have your higher self come forth today to give you the information that you need to hear for your highest good. Okay, so decide which crystal you're going to have for your reading. And here we go. Hey, amethyst. Or rose quartz. It's always exciting to see what comes up for the week. Clear quartz, people. <laughs> okay, here we go. Ooh, this is very good. Start and goodbye. Exciting week for you. This is about moving forward and this is about starting something that you've been wanting to do. You're going to be saying goodbye to the old and moving on to the new. It's actually perfect, especially look how they're waving goodbye. So this also can literally also mean that you're going to be starting a trip or travel, which is great. And just to check it, we're going to use my Sabella cards and see if there's any more information or something else that you need to know for this week. Oh, and you're going to be hanging out with a group of people too. So this start is you're not alone. It's you're not uh, isolated at all. There's going to be people around you or to support you. So nice week for you. <laughs> okay, or a rose quartz. Let's see what's going on with you. Oh, wow. <laughs> These are great. Um, this is um, Scared and Castle. This is also be, talking about a start. So this is about building your dreams. And also, it can also be about you, maybe you're going to be building a house or starting a house or working on a house. Um, but this can be also building your, your dreams of things you want. Um, and don't be scared. This is saying you are starting the foundation now. Um, you know, sometimes uh, when you want to do something and you're afraid to do it, you don't know how to take the first step. There's baby steps again you can do. You can start by just making a list of the things that you want and then um, slowly do the research, whatever else. And, and doing those steps open the doors and make it not as scary. But for those of you who have already planned what you want to do, um, your foundation is there. So don't let that fear get in the way. You know, fear is not productive. So <laughs> good for you. Exciting. Claire Quartz, let's make it a triple. A <laughs> good week for everybody. Oh my goodness, it is a good week for everybody. <laughs> um, I literally good. The snake, the snake is not bad. Snake is amazing. Snake, actually, snake can be very um, sexual, kundalini energy. So this is um, talking about um, you're going to feel empowered this week. Um, you know, go ahead and feel and buy that that sexy new pair of shoes. Are um, very exciting. Um, if you have a feeling there's somebody you like, it's saying, okay, go ahead and, and allow those feelings to happen. Um, if you're thinking maybe tonight's the night that you want to spend the night with that person, hey, looking good. But let's see what Sabella has to say. <laughs> it's the lover card, definitely. For, for, for those of you who um, are excited wow this is a definitely a validation that they came through for you okay and for those of you who aren't in a relationship right now this is telling it's a good time for you to kind of like uh venture out there um go ahead this week and you know go out with friends for uh, coffee or dinner or expand that um that uh, perimeter for you okay um it's actually a good time to to forge ahead Wow. So I'm really excited for you all this week. This is really a great week. So please like, comment, tell me how your week went. Subscribe. I'm really looking forward to hearing from you. Have a wonderful week. Thanks for watching.